Quick video on the dimmer cabinet here. First we'll go over this switch here, this red one. It is a light switch for yeah that light right there, so it doesn't do much. Bright, down is dim, and the middle is off. So we'll keep that on bright for now. Uh, now there's a switch there uh, that is supposed to be... Well, that's quite strange, it's missing. But uh, that's where the switch uh, for the dropping screen goes. But the dropping screen switch appears to be missing. And that is a new, okay, well, there's some changes going on here. Uh, these switches here, well, the ones with the tape residue on top, they're fuse switches. Those are for the footlights in the theater, okay? Just those two, one for the left, one for the right. All these big switches up here, they indicate what each of the channels on the board are for. So each, there are 24 channels on your light board out in the house, as numbered here. So if I want channel one on the light board, to control light bulbs uh, number three and four, all I have to do are take switches three and four, slide them up like that to control, to be controlled by fader one. Now, how do I know which light bulb is which number? That's what this tech map of the theater is for. And uh, this is your DMX translator, so if you ever want to bring the light board backstage, you just got to plug it in right there like it is now, or this goes out to the uh, house snake so you can put it up uh, where the sound booth would be. And uh, there's a dimmer cab in a nutshell.